本店本店はい、はい、本店本店本店大変です、はい、大変ですはい3号機多分水蒸気だと爆発が今起こりましたはいはい緊,緊急連絡11時1分です11時1分了解、はい、緊急連絡します On March 11th, 2011, the Tohoku region Pacific Coast earthquake generated a tsunami, causing the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power station to go into station blackout and lose the functionality of numerous safety facilities. These conditions led to a severe accident. Four years on since the accident, and as we continue to work on decommissioning the power station, Tokyo Electric Power Company, or TEPCO, is determined not to write off this accident as a natural disaster. その巨大な津波を予測することはまあ困難だったという理由によって、今回の事故原因を天災と片付けてはならないということでございます。陣地を尽くして。事前の備えによって防ぎ防ぐべきものあるいはもう絶対防げなければならないような事故を防ぐことができなかったということにこのこういう結果についてですね真摯に受け止めなければいけないというふうに思っております。TEPCO perceives this accident as an incident that should have been prevented with advanced preparation and attributes the failure to the lack of sufficient safety awareness, technological capabilities, and the ability to promote dialogue. Upon this reflection, we have concluded that our progress can only come from the reform of TEPCO itself. Firstly, we initiated an organizational reform to transform TEPCO's age-old corporate structure. The management team has been renewed with directors with the authority of representation being dismissed and creating a new management team with the majority invited from external organizations. We're also working on thoroughly streamlining business management, including workforce reduction. Under the leadership of a newly hired manager, new organizational units to supervise and advise the president and staff has been established both inside and outside the company to transform the way our organizational structure works. The reform does not stop with the organizational structure. The key to reforming TEPCO is to change the mentality of each and every employee. We must abandon the myth of the absolute safety of nuclear power, squarely face all risks, and develop countermeasures, assuming that an accident could happen rather than denying the possibility provides a sound foundation for developing safety measures. That is the mentality reform we are aiming for. Under this mentality reform, we are implementing a series of safety measures here are some of the examples. Lack of facilities and skills. At Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power station, the turbine building was built at 10 meters above sea level, based on the estimation that a tsunami would hit a maximum of 6.1 meters. However, largely exceeding our estimation, a maximum height of 15.5 meter tsunami rushed and hit the turbine building. That is why Kashiwazaki Kariwa Nuclear Power Station has a seawall measuring 15 meters above sea level, even though the tsunami prediction there is up to 6 meters. あの福島第一の事故を受けて海抜15メートルの堤防を作ってまいりました。その目的は2つあります。一つはやはり津波というものは想定が超えるものがやってくるものだという考え方です。そういった時にも
原子炉を冷却する設備あるいは電源設備を必ず守りたいこの思いが一つでありますそしてもう一つはそういった大震災の時に緊急事態策要員は余震の中活動をいたしますそういった緊急事態策要員が落ち着いてしっかりと活動できるようにこれでもかという大きさの堤防を作りたいと思い15メートルの防潮堤を建設してまいりましたそれでも津波はコーナーに入ってくるかもしれませんその時に備えて高台に大きな電源車も配備をいたしましたそして原子炉を守るために消防車も配備をいたしております想定を超えたものに対しては人間が最後は力を発揮しなくてはいけない人間だから応用力が効くそういった緊急時活動ができるという考え方に基づいたものですしたがって想定を超えるものに対してしっかりと自律的に現場がその現場状況に応じて活動ができるようにこういったことを念頭において緊急時訓練を重ねております We also recognize the need to reinforce the safety awareness of workers who operate these facilities. That's why a safety application group has been established in safety administrative department to help workers voluntarily organize study sessions in day to day efforts. あの保全の人が例えばあの機器をメンテナンスするのが仕事。運転の人が出来上がったその設備なりをきちんと動かす。おかしなところがないか日々パトロールするとかそういうのが仕事ですよね。で、改善推進グループの仕事ってあのマニュアルの要求事項だけではないところの隙間で何がどんなことをやったら発電所が良くなるのかということを常に考えていなくちゃいけなくて、安全文化の醸成っていうのが私の仕事であり、発電所の職員あと東京電力の職員までを含めてあの安全意識を高めるっていうのがうちのチームあのうちのグループの業務大きな業務なんです。Lack of communication. TEPCO's lack of sufficient communication created uncertainty among the people of Fukushima and the rest of the nation. This has led to the introduction of the Risk Communicator System. Risk communicators are assigned to disclose all risks associated with nuclear power stations and engage in community dialogue to answer questions and address uncertain factors in good faith. あのやはり気候前後という点で大きな違いはやはりあの大概的に原子が事故前は原子関連者はまあ安全なものという点をまあかなり主張していたという点がまあ結果的にはまあ間違っていたという点についてはまあ我々は反省かなと思う現時点においては事故が起こるという前提でまあ安全対策等の取り組みをしているという点についてまあ我々まあ継続的に実施中ですしまあそういった点をですがまああの実際さんまた周辺の住民の皆様にですがご理解いただくというのがまあ。あのまあ、我々の使命かなというふうに思っております。万が一の際の,その避難に関するまあ避難計画等についてもですが、まあ、我々もご協力、まあ、連携する形でまあ協力していきたいというふうに考えております。わかりました、ちょっと,ちょっと私に主導権取らせてください、本店さん、いいですかいいですかこれから私に主,主導権取らせてください、吉田です。どうぞ,どうぞあのいいですか One of the factors that caused the Fukushima accident to escalate was the delay in making decisions at the time of emergency. The delay was attributable to confusion generated through interactions among multiple decision makers. In response, we have defined a clear decision making process, with the decision making authority given to the plant chief of the nuclear power station. The head office will concentrate on following decisions and assisting site operations. With safety given the absolute top priority, we will work towards separating safety authority from management authority. So, to be able to get rid of the risk, we will be able to get rid of the risk. And we will be able to get rid of the risk. And we will be able to get rid of the risk. And we will be able to get rid of the risk. 安全を第一優先に対処してまいります
there are no perfect safety measures. To listen to all the opinions expressed by you, to identify areas for improvement, and to continue to evolve day by day to achieve a higher level of safety, those are TEPCO's responsibilities as a nuclear licensee. The foundation of safety measures begin from assuming that accidents happen. With this mentality reform in place, we will continue to strive step by step in all sincerity. What is going on over there in the corner? What is going on? Oh my god. No, Karen. Okay. Recording. <laughs>